Hello everyone, I hope you're doing very well. This is a thank you video for a care package that I received from one of our loyal YouTube followers. I think I can call her a friend now. Uh, obviously I have to be very careful what, what I say because this person is from a frontline active fighting unit and so I've got to be careful not to divulge any uh, information. Um, so I'll have this video reviewed before it comes out just to make sure it's okay. But what I believe I can say is that this person who um, interacts with our group uh, flew a mission uh, or was involved in flying a mission in Afghanistan, I think I can say that, uh, where some bombs were GBUs, well, I think they were GBU-12s, were dropped and um, this person consulted the Reapers first to see if we wanted any slogans emblazoned on the two bombs that were dropped and we had a democratic review and decided the things that were going to be written on the bombs, I better not say what they are because they're a bit rude and um, and they were put on the bombs, the bombs were dropped in the mission and then we've got the some merchandise or I don't know what the word is, some memorabilia from that mission. Uh, so we'll go over it, we've got the Union Jack because as you know we are a British group, we have plenty of Yanks and Poles and others and Germans and whatnot, but we are a British group at heart, which is really cool. Um, the squadron involved is this, it's the 104th Fighter Squadron or the 104th EFS, what is it, the um, Expeditionary Fighter Squadron. We've got the 104th T-shirt, uh, because the 104th, I, um, uh, the planes involved were these hogs. As you can see, hog bird. Yes, this is gonna be my new fancy. I'm gonna wear this to riot this year now. <coughs> bird. Cool, right? Just my size as well. And uh, we've got these. I've got to be careful what I say here, but these may or may not have been part of the two GBUs that may or may not have been dropped in a mission that may or may not have happened. With, that may or may not have had our logo emblazoned on it. Just saying, that may or may not be true. But I hold the camera still because I may have to cut some of this out. But uh, this is a plaque that comes with it, United States Air Force. This Union Jack was flown in the skies of Afghanistan on a combat mission aboard the feared A-10C Warthog while air refueling with Shell 28, assigned to the 104th Expeditionary Fighter Squadron, Kandahar Air Base, Afghanistan. Operation Freedom Sentinel, flown in honor Operation Fr Freedom Sentinel, flown in honour of Cap, that's me, and I won't say it just in case, but you can see the pilot's name and whatnot there, and the 104th and the other uh, badge there. So yeah, just wanted to say thanks very much, because obviously, you know, it's difficult to organise all this stuff and send it out. It's very much appreciated. I will, I'm going to wear that, um, and for that I'm going to find a way of putting on the car on eaves um, and I'm going to drive around just to make sure they all know that I'm British and that I'm going to put up on my wall and then I'm going to keep in my drawer of fancy things that I've got and that patch I'm going to put somewhere I'm not sure yet. Right, um, yeah that's all I want to say, see you later.